The House has approved the Republican budget bill. This would fund the government for three more months, just three, but at the same time defund Obamacare. Right now you can see House Republicans, uh, you could call it a pep rally, high fives, back patting, whatever you like, before uh, sending this bill to the Senate where it is sure to be defeated by Democrats. Uh, Peter Cook, our chief Washington correspondent, back with us. Peter, uh, pretty straightforward, right down party lines almost, right? Uh, a little straying here or there. I saw at least one Republican voted against it. At least two Democrats voted in favor of it. But basically, along party lines as we expect. And this is a pep rally you're seeing right now. John Boehner and others showing unity right here among House Republicans. We will see, Eric, if they have that same measure of unity a week from now. That's when we expect that Democrats in the Senate will send this bill right back to them. But without that Obamacare language, what does John Boehner do at that point? Will his Republican colleagues stand with him and pass a clean CR or at least something that uh, that doesn't include Obamacare. That is the question, and that uh, was what we're going to have to find out about a week from now. And right now, the chances of that feel pretty slim, correct? Well, uh, no, I, I'm not sure it is that slim. I mean, think what you can do at that point, if he's John Boehner, is he can uh, use Republican support and some Democrats to get the measure he needs to to uh, avoid a government shutdown. It's the threat of the shutdown that ultimately will get John Boehner to.